Hi, this is Michael from Messed Up Coding Tutorial, and in this video, I'll show you how to use GoDaddy Studio Photo Editor that you can download from Play Store. But before we do, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated on my latest videos. So, as you can see, I have my Google Play Store up and running, and in here, search in GoDaddy. GoDaddy, alright, here it is. GoDaddy Studio Photo Editor from GoDaddy Mobile. And before we install this up, let's uh, take a look at the pictures in here. So these are the things that you can do with this app. Edit photos and create beautiful designs. 15 plus million downloads. It's amazing. Great on transitional content. Make your own logo. Remove backgrounds in seconds. Create, is, create a beautiful social site. Get started with stylish templates, make your posts stand out, get fonts, graphics, and layouts, and so on. Alright, let's go back and install it. And while waiting for it to complete, I just want to let you know that start and grow your small businesses with beautifully designed social site, free with GoDaddy Studio. Now you can build your brand's online presence easily in one place and connect it to your social profile with unique link in bio. So the top features available for this app, uh, graphic design discovers easy graphic design tools like our masking tools, also known as the eraser tool. You can edit images like a pro. For photo editor, you can add text and edit photos with filters in just a few taps. Logo maker, build your brand with ready-made templates. Video editing, layer videos with images, graphics, text, add filters, and so on. Flyer Maker Choose from graphic design templates to create your show stopping flyer. Background Remover uh, You can cut out items to create clean, professional product shots. Story Maker Design eye catching story templates for Facebook and Instagram. And Banner Maker You can choose from banner templates to expand your market across social media and YouTube. Poster Maker Create You can create artwork for your walls or advertisements. All the best graphic designs and photo editing tools all in one app. And also this is the best design tools at your fingertips all in one place. Discover design layouts for faster creation. Choose, choose from over 1,700 stylish templates or start your own blank design. Create logos with over 67,000 ready to use graphics. Pick from a selection of over 500 fonts in our poster maker, banner maker and flyer maker and limited access to the best stock images, wallpapers, and canvases. Get inspired by ready-to-use templates in our logo maker, story maker, flyer maker, and poster maker. Video editing made easy for you. You can add your own video or select a video from our exclusive stock library and stand out with unique immersive content. You can also use the background remover to edit photos in just a few taps. Alright, it's done. Let's, let's go ahead and open it. Welcome, over is now GoDaddy Studio. Let's get started. Alright, to get started, you have to create an account first. So, you can continue with your Facebook, continue with Google, or continue with email. So, this part here, I'm going to skip this part since I'm going to put in my personal details. Alright, I'm done creating an account and right now it's uh, loading. So, let's go ahead and uh, wait for it to completely load up. So don't mess out. Allow push notifications to stay up to date with the latest. So you can uh, allow notifications. Uh, but for me, I'm just going to not not for now. What would you like to design? So let's say that uh, I'm gonna edit. Uh, right. So from here, you will see your own photos and uh, videos that you can uh, use for your editing. Alright, so camera, GoDaddy, and uh, more. So if you tap the more, then you will see more of your uh, photos. You can access your local files. GoDaddy is where you can access uh, their files, their images online. Okay, so this is where you can uh, connect with your social media. You can add Im images if you want to. Let me just uh, go back. And camera is where you can uh, take a photo of yourself. You can take a selfie and then you can edit it. So logos tab, you can add the logo. So add your logos here for quick access in your graphics. And then photos and un splash. This is the library or free images that you can use. 
under the Unsplash tab. Pixabay is also the same as Unflash and Splash. So you can use uh, this uh, photo uh, for your uh, projects. So it's up to you. So I'm just going to use uh, photos from Unsplash and I want to try out this one I think okay let me just uh, try this one so it's going to download the image first before we can start editing and here it is so it's done download downloading so we have this option below images text graphics shape videos and palettes so for the images if you want to replace it you can do so and text if you want to add text something to write so let's just say that I love this app something like that and this one here if you tap this you will have the option to you have the option to change the text attribute so if you want to justify it if you want to put it in the center in the right justified or the left justified it's up to you so let me just uh, put it in the center and uh, tap the check mark at the top right there you have it so you can uh, add the text in here just drag the text to the place you want to put it like this one here at the bottom the bottom side and you can also change the style so in here you see that there's a lot of fonts that you can choose from so if you if you notice it changes automatically so you just have to select the images and then the changes will take effect real time so there is this one and you can also have the option to change the style there the alignment so text style you have the option to put it in here the right side just right justifica justified there so center and then spacing if you want to add spacing there you can also do that if you want the text to all caps lower caps title caps it's up to you and a curve as well you can also do that color you can change the color as you can see we have this color palette in here so right now it's color white you can use the hex value if you want to just change this and you can also use this one here just uh, look or find the best color that you want that you want to use and then once you're done just hit the check mark here on the right side I'm not going to do that because I want the white text so I'm just going to cancel it and uh, apply the default which is the white text size is where you can uh, adjust the size there you can adjust the size of your text by making it uh, smaller or bigger it's up to you and shadows if you want to apply shadows blur there opacity you can also adjust that and rotation you want to rotate it, nudge, mask, blend, and uh, so on. Let's say that we're done with, let's say that we're done adding this uh, text. You can also add filter to your photos. So just uh, tap the photo. Okay, so the, right now the photo is highlighted instead of the text. So below you will see that we have this uh, filter. So you can tap any of the filters and you will notice that the photo has changed okay these changes will take effect right away so just uh, look for the filter that you want to apply okay they have this uh, black and white you can also do that and let me just uh, I think that I like this one all right that that's one so you also have the option to remove uh, image background so it's going to take for a while to complete the removal of the background so I'm just going to skip that part adjust is where you can uh, adjust the color so contrast exposure saturation warm fade and uh, so on crap is where you can crap is where you can uh, adjust the size or crop your images so custom if you want to custom there you can just uh, drag it like this it's uh, up to you turn off if you don't want to uh, apply crap so square so you also have this sizes in here 
so I'm just going to turn it off and then size okay you have this option to uh, change the size it's up to you and the shadows and opacity blur and uh, so on so let's just say that we're done with the editing and uh, we want we want to save this now so we just have to tap the check mark here the top right portion and there it's now saved so okay if you tap this you will see the image here so you can now tap the check mark and then save it so export one page so you can save it there saving save it on our gallery on this phone so it's going to take for a while depending on the image size all right so one page saved successfully you can also save it or share it to your friends via social media so let's just go back and explore other things in here so templates this is where the home page is projects is where our projects so if you notice we have one uh, projects created in here so all of your projects projects will appear in here right now we have one so we added that photo though and in here is the templates that you can use so if you don't want to uh, edit manually you can just use the ready template or predefined template for you so you can choose uh, you can choose uh, so there's a variety of designs that you can choose from uh, from pets Okay, you can even search in here uh, what uh, let's say that for Facebook okay for Facebook and there so all of these are for Facebook related posts or images that you can use so instead of manually editing it you can just uh, use and use any of these and then just edit the text and you will have your own design right away so let's say that I want to I want this one so first it's going to download the template before you can uh, add some text or edit the text so this is uh, again free to use all right it's done downloading so here is the image or the image template that we can use so we just have to edit the text so that it will become our our work all right so in here you can uh, edit the te text change text duplicate it's up to you so let's just uh, change the text and uh, let's say that this is going to be our our sample our example text and then once done you can just uh, tap the check mark and there you have it so you can just uh, manually edit it and then once you're done with the editing then just uh, save it by tapping the check mark at the top right portion and then this one here at the top right again to export it or save it to your uh, phone so let's just uh, save it on my phone there it's now saving so that's how easy it is to create a template so you can you just use the predefined templates in here for your businesses for your uh, advertisements if you want to promote your products online then just uh, use the predefined template so that you'll get the work done faster so I, as you can see there's a lot of images here a lot of uh, templates that you can use so you can just uh, go with the templates and uh, there you have it so there's really a lot there's a lot to choose from depending on your needs so from foods to online business to your uh, banners, YouTube banners, logos, it's really up to you. You don't have to do it manually, but if you want to, then you just, then you just have to tap this plus icon here and you can uh, start creating your own project from scratch. So as you can see, you can choose the uh, project size, okay? portrait landscape or your Facebook mobile Facebook so it's really up to you so I don't uh, want to use this because you, you have to put uh, a lot of effort just to make uh, uh, I don't usually do this because uh, it's going to take some time it's time-consuming by the way so I don't recommend this 
instead of uh, doing the uh, projects manually then why not just use the these uh, predefined templates in here there's really a lot so you just have to search uh, you just have to scroll down and look for the images or you can use the search here to filter the result let's say that for YouTube just like that and all the result will be related to YouTube so this will be your banners okay you want to use this for your YouTube then go ahead and do so just edit the text for your YouTube like for example this one here if you have uh, music if you have a YouTube music channel then just uh, use the this images here for your YouTube so alright so this is best metal albums of 2019 then just uh, edit the text and put your own uh, YouTube channel and then you can use it then save it just like that then save so that's how easy it is to use this application and I highly recommend this to anyone who wants to so that's how easy it is to use this application and I recommend this to anyone who wants to create their own brand identity with this easy to use a logo maker you can create your own design draw or select a logo template to make design and apply it to your marketing materials uh, you can use the banner maker to promote your brand across uh, Facebook and YouTube. Promote your products or brands with simple and stylish flyer. So again, the design, you can choose from over 1,700 stylish templates or start your own brand design. It's up to you. You can create uh, logos with over 67,000 ready-to-use graphics. I highly recommend this app because it's the best design tools that you can use all in one place all right so that's it for this video and i hope that you have learned something for today thank you so much for joining me and i'll see you next time